As promised, uh, some video here to demonstrate these drills. The athlete is assistant coach Jessica Barnes, uh, who herself was an NC2A qualifier during the 06-07 school year, I believe it was, in the 500-yard freestyle for Penn State. Uh, so not an elite sprinter, but certainly an elite swimmer uh, demonstrating these drills. The key, again, we're looking for high elbow in all phases of the stroke, and we are looking for the athletes to not drop the hand in by the head and slide it forward. We want distance per stroke on the recovery uh, and not sliding through the water. So, hope you enjoy. Thank you for watching and reading, as always. Left, right, freestyle. Working on 30 to 45 degree rotation each side. Tips down on the entry, driving the legs through the recovery. Second drill is straight arm. Working on tips down entry, early vertical forearm. Trying to get as long as possible. All right, the third drill is swimming with an anti-paddle. We call these mouse paddles because they look like a computer mouse, circa. 1989. We'll get a close up here of the paddle. You can see there the shape of it. Not a lot of pulling, not a lot of surface area. What that does is engages the forearm, so we're looking for an early vertical forearm uh, with no hands. No hands. All right, the fourth one here is what we call fly paws. So it's a fly stroke, double arm fly stroke. And she's actually going to pause here and look. Right there, she's looking to see where her arms are. Looking to see that she's got that early vertical forearm. Looking to see that tips are down. Fingertips below the wrist. And normally we want that head position nice and, nice and neutral, nice and level. But on this drill, we don't mind that they pick their head up and actually look to see where their fingertips are in relation to their wrist and where their wrist is in relation to their elbow. All right, we had to move inside. We're not in the outdoor long course pool any longer. Simmons board drill here. Big keys are hips up, arms at the side, not resting on the board, not controlling the board. Head neutral in line with the spine. Pretty good stuff. As I mentioned, we can do Pretty much all of these drills on the tower. Here I'll show you left, right on the tower. You'll notice the legs have to be driving on the recovery the whole time. Now there's absolutely no water in the bucket, just an empty bucket. So that's not, not all that challenging. If we're going full 25, we'll have them count the strokes. Looking for a big recovery, tips down on the entry, driving the legs, looking for balance. Now she's a lefty, she's left-handed, and the trained eye can see here, she's not quite as strong on her right side. So that's something that we want to look at in practice. You can see it's not quite as put together or as coordinated. 